Welcome. In this video, we will walk through the Insight Snap homepage. Here you can find details about your device and the application that it is running. Let's take a look at what is displayed on this step. To access the general settings of your Insight Snap, click the cog, the gear icon in the top right of the home screen. The device details is where you find your Insight Snap sensor's name, model, the firmware version that it is running, as well as check if the device inputs and or outputs are enabled. The Manage Communication Settings button opens the communication setting menu for you to change your preferences as needed. The Manage Network Settings button opens the Network Settings menu. This is where you can change the sensor's name or configure its IP address. To edit your device's name, enter the new name in the Host Name field. Your Insight Snap will default to DHCP Communications. If you wish to change it to a static IP address, then disable the DHCP toggle. Once DHCP is toggled off, you can enter your IP address, subnet mask, default gateway, DNS server, and domain name in the corresponding fields. To save any edits you've made, click the blue Apply Network Settings button at the bottom of this page. The Program Information area is where you can find details about the program you are using. This includes the slot number, example images, the dates for creation, and recent modifications made to the program. The Manage Programs button opens the Program Management menu, which allows you to manage your programs for the active application. Take note here that programs are linked to the app that they are under. To change from an Anomaly Detector app to a two-class classifier app, you will need to click the App Management tab. The Insight Snap All App device can run different AI applications. To switch between any of your purchased applications, click the Switch to this app button to change apps. Once you have selected your app, click the Create New Blank Program option. Then click the Switch App button to select a new program for your selected app. Here is some information to keep in mind when deciding which app to use. The two-class classifier is a tool used to categorize parts into passing or failing classes. For example, verifying product variations, presence absence, or known defects. The Anomaly Detector app is best suited for applications inspecting a single part variation with unknown or undefined defects. Example applications for the two-class classifier could be a presence absence check on a package or checking to see if a metal bearing is missing its cover. Example applications for the Anomaly Detector could be a part with many different defect types, like EV batteries with surface level defects, or a part with unknown or undefined defects like a medical pack with debris inside. Last, you have the Monitoring View. To navigate to the Monitoring screen, click the Enter Monitoring View button. Once setup has been completed, proceed to Step 2, Adjust Image. Thank you for watching.